news releases. Let's talk news releases. Looking through a variety of different public company websites, I've noticed recently that First of all, sometimes their news is really hard to find. That should be, at the very least, a menu option standalone that says news. It shouldn't be buried in some sort of sub-menu from the main menu. Have a menu option that is news, and that will take the investor straight to the news. They want to see it, so why make it really difficult for them to find it? Um, the second thing I've also noticed is that sometimes when you click on the title or it says read more or whatever, Sometimes it's a PDF. It may open up in a new window, but sometimes it doesn't. And that means that from an SEO standpoint, all of your keywords and all of the things that are happening in your news release that Google might want to know about, it might pick up as part of your company name, your exchange tags, your relevant news that day is all being picked up by Google and Google bots. And if it's a PDF, Google can't read a PDF. So it makes it really hard for us from an SEO standpoint. As well, if that PDF doesn't open up in a new window, you may have lost me. So I might get where I was because it's a PDF. So I might just close down that tab as well on a, from a mobile perspective. There's so many more investors these days that are looking at websites and news releases on their mobile and a PDF on a website that is mobile friendly. Probably the PDF is not mobile friendly. So the best practice would be to add your news release as a blog post on WordPress website, or at the very least add it as like straight text into the, the page where the news release is going to sit from an SEO standpoint, considerably better. Obviously look at it on a mobile phone and make sure that it's looking proper on a mobile home phone. It's not too big. It's not too small. All the words are readable. They don't fall off the edge of the page on your mobile, etc. And then of course, if it's a PDF and it's opening in the same window, you're not going to lose me. So those are three really important reasons why your news release should not be a PDF. You can always offer that PDF option, which I have noticed on a few different sites. You can read the news release right there on the page, but then you can also click to download and it will allow you to download that PDF into your computer. All, both great options, but have the option available.